Ken Hovind, like a lot of other creationists, likes to blame evolution and Darwin for racism and, in particular, the eugenics movement. Charles Darwin's cousin, Francis Galton, started a movement called the eugenics movement to purify the human race. Let's get rid of some of these inferior races. They drew in from all branches of science to make eugenics, to improve humanity. We could spend days talking about eugenics, but these ideas gave rise to American laws that em empowered doctors to sterilize people they judged to be unfit. As a result, Black estimates that some 60,000 people were sterilized in the United States over the course of the 20th century. Some doctor thought, oh, they're not fit to be a mom or a dad. They sterilized them. It's in America. The most chilling, though, were the ways which American eugenics introduced, influenced their German counterparts. Hitler said, I have studied with great interest the laws of several American states concerning the prevention and reproduction by people whose progeny would, in all probability, be of no value or be injurious to the racial stock. But wait, there's more in this little interview with Bastard Anderson, I mean, Pastor Anderson. Something is changing. I think there is something in the genetic code that deals with the disposition toward uh, gentleness or meanness. And I think in God's perfect law, if we would continually eliminate, execute people that do see certain crimes, we would gradually get a much better society that people, not so many people have this mean gene in them. Is it just me or does that sound like eugenics? Does it sound like getting rid of the bad genes in the gene pool? It was a bad thing when it could be blamed on Darwin? But if you use Old Testament laws to execute gays and people who disrespect their parents, which is the subject of this interview, this conversation, they're discussing who can we execute. And Pastor Anderson, being the complete fruitcake that he is, is pointing out, along with Ken Hovind, all kinds of laws in the Old Testament like adultery, for which we can execute people, and that would clean up the gene pool. But eugenics is a bad thing, because that's Darwinist. Okay, I think I get it now. You're batshit crazy. <laughs>